Welcome back everyone to Pineleaf Plays the Bjorning. Here is Talon Haldir where I have turned in those quests. And now I'm about to head up. I guess I'll be east into the main part of Lothlorien. Where we will get to actually see the Golden Wood. Now, there used to be that if you got too close to the Golden Wood and did not yet have acquaintance standing with them, you would be shot. That doesn't happen anymore in any case. I completed Book 6. And Book 6, w one of the rewards on that was enough rep in order to actually... No, I think I have missed this one. I think this is the reason why I never complete the deed for finding all the flats is because I think I keep on missing that one. Alright, now I really want to head north, I think, though, in order to continue on my way here, but... Ah, there's a bridge there. And that bridge should be useful in that. So let's do a little... a few Lothlorien quests. Since I think we've done plenty that are on the outskirts. It's not like we're planning on getting a major level of rep here. Now, I find it strange that with Lothlorien you start with neutral. You would think that they would have started out with outsider. And that would be neutral where you would no longer be shot at. They should have thought of that way because they always talk about not allowing outsiders into the woods and all that stuff. They really should have let that go thematic. I know they can do it because that's exactly what they did with Four Hell. Except with Four Hell, they don't shoot you. <laughs> but that's an entirely different matter. All right. So here's the golden wood with these Malorn trees with this unusual color of bark. I know that I know that they were des described as being silver color and all that stuff, and that's the reason for the color of the bark here. But whenever I see one of these trees like this, it I can't help but getting the feeling that the something's wrong with the tree because the silver color makes it look as if the bark had been stripped off. Because I'm so used to seeing brown trees being brown and that when you as only when something stripped off the bark and the tree is sick do you ever see anything like that color all right Karen now well I really oh, hang on is this a scholar no paradise or something I mean really three all together I can see why they haven't been seen. Probably wasn't taken because they're all hidden in the bushes. <laughs> the elves, they like to guard their secrets. <laughs> That's for sure. Alright. Now, let's... Where were we going? Oh. Well, here is Kieran Amroth. I guess we might as well do a few Cameron Amroth quests since that is where they actually told us to go. Though there is also there are also a bunch of quests involving orcs somewhere in that area. Some I usually wind up going through those flats, but I missed it this time. There are a couple of flats there where they send you up into there. But I've done those quests enough times, so Let's go uh, this way. And down here. Whoops. Down here. Down into the valley. And here we go. Uh, that's quite a roof to have up here. Interesting. 
For this angle, the leaves look they look green rather than golden. Interesting perspective, especially considering the. Or maybe they are green. Maybe in this valley they. You would think it would be golden this time of the year rather than green. Since it's a little bit early for trees to be having their leaves out. Welcome to Kareen Amroth. Few only have had the joy of seeing this place. Oh, that's the epic storyline. Let's see, is there anyone here who's not part of the epic storyline? Well, 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 well. Maybe? Surely there are, there are other quests here. Alright, let's go. Where are all the quest givers? I know they're here somewhere. They're hiding from me. Quest givers in hiding. They're saying there's a bee warning coming up here. Hide, hide, hide. Oh, here we go. Here's the location. This big tree here. You have discovered Kieran Amroth. Kieran Amroth, February 15th. This is an unusual one because it's one of the few place locations that actually give you the date that you are there and that sets it that we are in the middle of February and this place looks very green for a place in middle February now it is now while Florian does tend to be in a protected valley I guess not sure how the prevailing weather patterns work that could bring it air that's particularly warm or cold or anything like this. We've got Lothorian here, Fangorn down here, and, and it's a bit compressed when you consider how far Fangorn and Lothorian are would be from each other. The Great Fo the Great River, East Rohan, West Rohan, Orthanc, Eriador there, Southern Mirkwood there. We don't do much in Wilderland or Dagger ladder rune, but we're getting pretty close to Mordor. Well, not now. I mean, I mean where the latest updates were. Hello there. Greetings. If you have a moment, I have need of your assistance. Megavon and friend, I am Minasio. How fare you, and whither you go, you? I, I, I am here to gather some of the Eleanor from the grove so brightly upon the hill. An extract from the juice from its stem and heart make a marvelous gold and yellow color. The creation of pigments and paints is the art upon itself, nearly as engaging as the uses of which I and my fellow artists put them. Unfortunately, it is time-consuming unless, if you had some time to aid me, it would be most appreciated. You will not have the knowledge of refining the raw ingredients, but you could help gather them. Stark white chalk can be pried out of the solid white rocks along the north face from here. Berries can be found in local plant life, providing the base for the vibrant red dye. These bushes grow, bushes grow in relative abundance in the forest of Kiranamroth. All right. The Lord and Lady have need of your services. Megavan and Bjorning, I am Malandranor, one of the wardens of the revered woodlands of Kirin Amroth, and I and my fellows have accepted the solemn charge of custodianship. We ensure that the forests are not thrown out of balance. 
a problem has come to my attention within the last few decades. A per oh, wait, 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 last few decades? <laughs> oh, good grief. <laughs> a particular bird, the Malbrethil, has not been been seen as often in the days past, and when it is sighted, the sapling seems spindly and overly delicate. I want you to find and examine some of these saplings, if you would, that we might determine the cause of this malady. I will suggest heading east, then northeast, once you are past the low white cliff. Wait. This you have been noticing for decades, and you're just not getting around to looking at it. Waiting for someone to send on the task, apparently. Good grief! Decades! Anyway, that's way to the east. I might as well go to this way since there are supposedly berries out in this direction. Decades. Just a few decades. Elves. Elves, elves, elves. Alright. Uh, just a couple of decades. Uh. Alright. Well, let's collect some chalk at least. Yeah, 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 yeah. Scream, 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 scream. Alright, that's two. I wasn't expecting to find white rock in this area. So it's a slightly different path than I was thinking I was going on. Alright. For some reason I thought I'd been going in the opposite direction of that, but obviously I was completely wrong in that conjecture because I found four of the five. Well, we'll have to worry about the fifth one later. <laughs> that grief! I was thinking that I was ignoring the... Uh, it decided not to attack me. Fine! If it's a scaredy cat, I'll stay away from it. Alright, now. Where were we? Okay, the berries are the ones that are all to the east. Okay, I thought they were both to the east. Now let's head back up here and take care of these saplings and see what's wrong with them. Because obviously the elves didn't have to take care of them in the last few decades. Good grief. Alright, let's stay away from the birds because they are protected birds and we're not allowed to kill the birds even though some of them like to threaten you and say stay away from me stay away from me. but they are protected so if they attack you you can't fight back unless you want to lose rep with the Fulkit Lothlorien I could imagine back in the days when you had to be acquainted if you're just barely a acquaintance and you smacked a protected bird actually I think it unlocked a deed when you hit acquaintance and it was the deed that was used to determine whether or not you were allowed in the golden woods so I don't think you would have been shot on sight instantly if you killed one bird <laughs> alright you have discovered Kirin Brethil Oh, let's have a look at this tree. The saplings are boughs are drooping and its bark looks brittle. Alright. Well, that's not good. Let's see what this sapling is like. The saplings boughs are Didn't I see that before? Well okay, obviously these aren't in very good shape.
Now, the big problem with this quest is I always think I always had trouble determining which ones I've already examined and which ones I haven't. Actually, it looks like this one is turning off and on properly. It might be the subsequent quest where I can never remember. Finding these saplings has always been a challenge, and this is actually, I think, the fastest I've gotten through the four of them. All right! There we go. Saplings taken care of. We still have some berries to worry about. And someone has left some reading material up here. Let's have a look at that. Where is it? Oh. Silly me. Hello. Oh, what do we have here? Once upon a time, Let's see. Look into sampling problem the first time we find a sucker to do it for us. <laughs> Figures. That's why they let me into the Golden Woods. I could do all these quests for them. You can imagine, they go from not wanting you in at all till, oh please, please prove that you are a friend of the Galathrim by doing this for me. Yep. MMO quest givers. Kirin Al Gala? Go. whatever. Kirin in Galath. Well, I'm sure there is a better way to pronounce that, and. We'll just have to inform our elf there about the. about the state of affairs. Actually, before I turn that in, let us see about those berries. I'm sure I got some berries around here somewhere. Berries, berries, berries. Red berry bush. Alright, good. <laughs> now I notice she's talking about Getting dye from the Elan or when you, in the quest text. But in the end, she doesn't give you a quest to look for Elanor, but I guess that does make a bit sense since I'm sure the Elanor is not in bloom this time of the year. As for these red berries here, th these must be these holly bushes. Now, actually, if this were a hollybush, I cannot imagine that in the number of animals that we've got in the Florian, that in February 15th, there would be a single holly with a berry remaining. You consider how scarce food gets during the winter time. You would think that by the time you hit February 1st, some animal somewhere would have found every single holly berry that there is to be found within the forest. Because it's one of the few plants that has that has food available in the winter time. And I can't think of and if there was another plant that had berries in the winter time I would think it would have the same fate as holly berries, I would, one would imagine. All right. <coughs> All right. Here you go. Sweet light, Rondir. Oh, you have returned. Thank you. Welcome to the Golden Wood. And it May we just speak. wants me to repeat it. What brings you to Lothlorien? 
Will you aid dun, the Dun dun dun. Oh, that's right. This is the other quest. That's right. I think I should have read the quest text of that one. All right. We'll get to the follow-up though in the next episode of Pinely Plays Law Beorty.